Sorry, guys, I accidentally hit the stop button for recording when I came into the game. But anyway, so this popped up immediately, as you can see. So this is what we are just reading about, and sure as shit, here they are. That is just so awesome. Thank you, Scopely, sincerely. This is amazing. And yes, they are three-star trainers, so... Haha, ha, I know it's still. <laughs> some some names still. We have so many characters now, it's almost impossible to keep up with them. Um and all their names. But yeah, super, super awesome. I mean, this was just amazing and, and super nice of them. So obviously I'm going to accept that gratefully and graciously. And again, thank you, Scopely. So here's the unequipped sale. Obviously, I highly recommend you do this every single time they give us the opportunity to. We only have a few hours left on it. Get it done. You can always put them on for free later. Pull them off as fast as you can. That's what costs you so much. So then we have got a lot of stuff going on here. All right, so let's go over and let's see. Regions. Beta. Beta 3, 2, 4. And it says I can return to all of them. All right, so let's go ahead and return to this one. Cancel real quick. Yeah, I haven't been here in a while. A long while, 2019. So, yeah, I, I, I'm not, you know, doing my part. So, are you sure you would like to switch regions? Your current progress in this realm will be saved. Any coins you own will also be usable across regions. So, you know, going into beta... And I've done this a million times over. We used to do it a lot, a lot um, when it first came out because, well, it, it was really helpful. But now it's just kind of, um, as you can see, a little overloaded. And they just give you so much when you first start that it really is just crazy. So these were just, you know, given to us um, when Six Stars came out. And then we had the ability to, you know, upgrade them and turn them into six stars and all of that and test all of these characters out. And that part was so cool. It is so cool to be able to see what these characters were doing and where they were going with it prior. And again, these were all, you know, just given to us to be able to test them out and make sure that this all worked before it was released to everyone else. Um, which I totally understand. Um what I don't is what they're saying about the live version and that and see like in here, none of the museum collections are here. You cannot get what we can in the game. Like this is definitely testing only in a very real way. All right. So we've got new listed here. What do we got? Um, so that's claiming stuff new here, new event, faction onslaught. That's it. Um, and clearly we haven't even touched it. This is in beta. So they did give beta a faction onslaught, which surprises me in, in all reality, honestly, especially seeing that it's so close. Um, but also could be, again, it's all for testing. And so then you have the same type of thing going on here, just a little, a little different. And then it kind of does pile up. I don't see anything else in here that is different at all. Yeah, there's no current roadmaps. World map. Um, nothing going on there. Arenas they don't have here. Um, territories, nothing going on here. And I mean, that's where you can see that people are playing, playing this game in beta instead of, you know, um, using it for exactly what it's for. Um, and then, yeah, there's just so many that you can't, you get to a point where you're, I got stuck with all of these and, you know, what do you do with all of them? <laughs> you can only use so many so fast and then you're wasting them. And, uh, and that's basically where it hits. So, and why I just base, I stopped and then we haven't had anything new, new come out. So I don't see anything here in beta right now. That doesn't mean it's not coming later. Um, let's see. I do want to go into this real quick. Yeah, I mean, same thing. Rosita, 
the gentleman. I don't know if we've seen him. I don't remember seeing him unless he's up right now, which if he is, okay, in the other game or in our live game. But if not, we might as well go over him. So he's a road to survival number two, the gentleman. Um, road to survival usually is a road to survival character that you can get what out of the depot. Um, I think I'm not again, hundred percent sure, but I want to say, I think that might be it or it's just a character off of, you know, road to survival. I, I don't know. Um, but I want to say that that's correct, but deals 1500, 1500 damage to one enemy. This character get, regains up to a hundred percent of their max HP. So, up to 100%. I don't even understand why they say that besides any other buffs that might be on it or uh, penalties, you know, that they can't heal, whatever. All right. Um, active skill is normalize. Um, four turns, 10 uses. The cooldown is far, but still 10 uses is awesome. Target gets um, normalized. Target enemy gets normalized for two turns. And then you've got Waste Night, not when the specialist kills an enemy with an attack and adrenaline rush. Any access da damage is dealt to one adjacent target. So meaning that um, he does a, a double attack if he has any attack left after hitting that one character. So if he kills the character, puts the character down, he'll do a second one if it's another one, okay? And then he obviously heals. He's solid. And I mean, his AP being normal, again, with that being red, you know, a huge bonus to AR when either attacking or defending um, with your mods, your leader skill buffs, you know, you're looking at shooting him off at least every other turn. You can honestly get him that fast. And once he's that fast, I mean, 1500% damage, 1000 500% damage and then he heals himself 100% without hitting with him with a heal reduction 100% heal reduction and I just don't see how you'd beat him and again he's red you're going to need a really powerful blue um, Priya and uh, Princess would be his match in all honesty Princess probably more than Priya she does a thousand um a, a thousand hits so and he also comes with his own weapon so the gentleman's violent silenced pistol 30 attack a medium, medium bonus to ap when attacking and when attacking a great chance to recover from taunt and impair and this character gains plus 35 percent bonus hp no shit oh my god that's unbelievable i've never seen that stat before when attacking a great chance so more than not, it's going to happen to recover from taunt and impair. So he's taunted or impaired. That's not going to shut him down because his gun, his weapon is going to allow his AR to still go off. And if it doesn't, it's still going to heal him and a bonus plus 35% HP. That's a lot. I mean, that's, he's going to be hard. <laughs> he is definitely going to be hard to put down. Um I'm excited to see him, and I definitely now want him. And how cool. His name is The Gentleman. I mean, I think that's super awesome. Obviously, we have Shiva, and we have Aaron, Clementine, Malcolm, Tiffany, and Davey. I think we have Malcolm. Road to Survival number two as well, so maybe not. Again, I'm just going to go over it. I haven't seen him that I know of. So um, deal 400% damage to align enemies. Those enemies get disarmed in days for two turns. So they're just screwed and dead very fast. And then recover, normalize, and AP game. So every by the every two turns, 10 times, wow, that's a lot, um, one other character recovers from normalize up to two teammates gain plus 20% AP. He'd be great just to go as a little buffer with the other dude. And as he continues to boost his AP up, that dude's going to go off like every turn. And then he has a leadership skill. All melee teammates get 30% attack and a huge bonus to AP when attacking. So their AR is going to go up as they attack. He is a perfect attack leader for a melee team. He's also great on defense. He's just a solid character and super powerful. I mean, he really is all the way around. Um, other than that, like I said, we have everyone else up and loaded from what I know. Um... 
it looks like this Rosita, she's a healer, right? And does the bide. And so this character regains up to 50% of their max HP for two turns and recovers from normalized. Up to two, two, two teammates gain 50% bonus HP and 50% defense for three turns. So yeah, good luck. Throw these three together and I don't know how you would ever even put those three down. Um, attack down and taunt. Every two turns, five uses, not ten, but still decent. Target enemy gets negative 50% attack for two turns, and all other enemies get taunt for one turn. So she's going to shut everybody down, and on top of that, she's got the bide, which, again, if you can't remember, bide, bide your time, stacks up, and then comes out. So this character stores the damage it takes from attacks, active abilities, and rushes. After reaching 2,000 stored damage... Or if the defense action is used, so I'll show you the defense action, but it really is like the same action you use to show, throw up your shields if you're manually playing, same thing. Deal. This character will then deal 150% of the stored damage to one enemy immediately. So 2,000 storage damage is going to be 150% of that to one character immediately, and that stored damage is resets to zero after each use and by does not trigger if this character is killed so the only way that this isn't gonna kick you in the butt later is if you put her down right away and i mean right away she'd be one of the first i'd go after but again those three i, I, I don't know how you'd put them down <laughs> that would be um interesting to say the very least all right so let's go in here and see what we got going on um, might as well open them up. I mean, they're sitting here again. I'm just in beta, not a big deal. Um, but you know, can always see if something cool pops up. P uh, police baton. I mean, decent weapon, 20 attack, 20 crit, 10 defense, just, you know, decent and basic and, and, and normal. Um, obviously the, um, okay. <laughs> obviously Whatever I get here, I don't, it's not going to impact me. So I really don't want to pull like a six star here or anything else. I do worry that that might take away my luck elsewhere. All right. So I was just talking about the defend and I do want to show you guys that real quick. Um, and then I do want to switch over and see if we have the gentleman up or in Malcolm or if they're just here right now being tested out and uh, go from there. And then, you know what, let's go look at this real quick. So we've got Krista and we've got Carl, Harlan, all pretty normal stuff. Again. Oh, wow. Look at how cheap these are. They're a dollar or one each, not a dollar each, but one each. And this is a survival road, Ezekiel. And that's what I'm saying is that survival road number two, I'm wondering, but there's a little icon next to his survival road. And so that might be the difference right there um, is that one is just a survival road character um, and one is actually can be purchased in the survival road store. And it says road to survival number two. And let me go back there one more time and check this uh, survival road. Yeah, so I don't believe you're going to be able to buy them here then. Um, and that might be what's changed is that these the verbiage is a little different here. Nothing huge, just a little bit of changes. All right, so like I said, I was going to show you how to go ahead and use this um, defend if you were to ever fight anyways. If you were to need to. Um, fun. All right, so yeah, I'm aware. I need to edit my team. I guess this is my team. <laughs> Honestly, I have no clue. Um, but autofill it will be just fine. All right, so when you are in here and you are going through and you're doing your attacks, we clearly know we can click on them and see all of their information. Now, if you can see down at the bottom, it says defend to swipe to the right. To swipe to the right, you're going to, that defended. So what he did was he just didn't take a turn. 
So that helps with your buy. That's what you do to use that. You defend um, if you want to go ahead and force it open. Obviously, if, you know, it's uh, zombies, anything like that, no big. But when you're in war, you're struggling, you're in rage, you're struggling, you're up against a hard team, et cetera, et cetera. That's when that's going to really help you. So it's real simple. You just slide it to the right. And again, I'm going to show you it here in just a second. All right. So we've got Donnie. And see how Donnie says defend to go to the right? Now, here's Eric, and he can go to the active skill, or he can defend. Left is active, right is defend. And then if he had the bide, he'd be good to go there. All right? So let's go ahead and finish this out real quick. And then you just saw waste not happen. I do love that they are showing these things. But I wonder, I don't think I have one in there. Not that I saw. Um, no ass class characters are here in beta yet. And that surprises me. It really does. But it could have been given as a gift and I wasn't here to get it. Um, you know, I, I haven't signed in in so long. Literally since um, I decided to change my entire life. So that speaks for itself. <laughs> it's been a, one hell of a year. Anyway, so... Um, I think these characters are definitely going to be worth it without a doubt. The thing with them being, though, is the next thought is S-class characters. For us veteran players, these six stars, again, are becoming obsolete real fast. So, um, anyone newer? Yeah, those definitely are epic characters that are just phenomenal characters. They just are. Um, oh, it's going to make me go through this. Send Darius with a crew. And thank you. And yes, I'm aware everything is just way over full. All right, so that's that. All right, so let's go on over to back to my region and see what is what. So we have, again, just before we go there real fast, so we remember the gentleman. We're going to see if he is in our live game. And we're going to go see if Malcolm is in the live game or if these are characters to come. So let's go check that out real quick. And I'm going to get this posted up for you guys and get the link in the bottom so that you can join Beta. If you have further questions, please don't hesitate to ask you guys. I'll definitely get you the answers the best that I possibly can. I'm obviously going to be asking a few myself. Um, all right, so we've got... Let's go right to here and let's see. Here we've got the gentleman. There he is. And Malcolm. We've got Eugene, Rosita. Everyone looks pretty much the same except for we have Eugene and they don't. And so, yeah, this these characters, I didn't even see the gentleman. I don't know when he popped up um, or if he's up now. So let's go check that out, actually. All right, we've got Eugene, which I did see that he popped up. And the two times chances, let's see, legendary, ascendable, collection item, legendary, ascendable, epic, ultra rare. I wonder where the two time, oh, here it is, legendary featured recruit, ascendable, epic featured recruit right at the top. So it's a 0.4% chance to get Eugene. So I guess normally it's a 0.2% chance. Um, well, then we can see it right here. So collection, legendary, featured recruit, 2.2%, but ascendable epic featured recruit, 0.4%. Well, if it's double, two times chances, I wonder, um, that's not two times chances for the ascendable one. Huh. That's odd. All right, so um, we've got Lewis, and I just got him and or was gifted him, and I had no idea, and that's it. So I don't know when these two popped up, in all honesty, but they really are strong and um, definitely worth it, in my opinion. And, well, I'm going to be looking for them now myself. All right, you guys, so that's it on this one. I just wanted to share some information, some good news with you guys. So, yay, thank you, Scopely, for the free stuff, checking out Beta. Now you guys kind of know what you can do and what you need to do and all those steps. And again, the link will be in the descriptions below. Thanks again for watching, you guys. You guys rock. Please stay safe and healthy out there. Let's all work together. 
If you need anything, please don't hesitate. We are here. I'm here um, to talk, to help you guys, whatever I can do. You need any ideas on videos, you need some help on team building, anything. Um, you're looking for a new faction. Hawk is always looking for great people. And we have plenty of room because we can make as many factions as we need. We currently have two. I'll make 17. If that's how many Hawks we have, that's how many Hawks we have. Um, and that number will never be a big deal to me. So, again, thank you for watching, you guys. Please don't forget to like, subscribe, and share. Um, it really does help me out to hit that subscribe button. So, please do so, you guys. And, again, thank you so much for watching. I really do appreciate the hell out of each and one of you. Sending you guys tons of prayers, hugs, and virtual hugs, obviously. And uh, positive thoughts and vibes all the way. Um, hoping everybody is uh, healthy and well. And, and those who aren't are kicking this virus's ass. You've got this. You're strong. You are going to make it through this. And mind over matter. Just stay positive And we're going to make it through. Just keep pushing and fake it till we make it, right? All right, you guys, so again, have a great weekend. Looking forward to seeing some cool stuff going on in the game um, as well this weekend and this new update that's coming out. Um, I would like to see exactly what it is or if it's just this update that we have going on now um, with a few little changes, you know, some verbiage changing, um, some rules a little adapted, and then obviously we've got some color changing and, and some graphic changes, and those are cool, and, and they're fun. I'm sorry, but glowing purple is cool. I like my purple glowing S class characters without a doubt in a very real way. <laughs> and they make me very happy. They're very, I think it's just very cool. So excited about it. All right, you guys, again, thank you. Thank you. Thank you for watching. Please hit that, that subscribe button for me and do me an even bigger favor. Be kind to one another and help each other through this. It's going to get a, a little stressful, but we're all going to be just fine. Promise.